Welcome to my channel, Light as a Feather Tarot. This is for the sign of Cancer, and this is for May 2020. So tarot, the energy is very fluid, so it may, you know, energy is coming from April through May going into June. However, overall, I am focusing my energies on May 2020. I want to thank you guys all. For all your support, for all of your likes, your, your subscriptions, I truly appreciate it. And let's look at the energy for May. Please take the messages that resonate. Leave the ones that don't. If you find that they're not resonating, then check out your rising or moon sign. All right, let's, so let's see what we got here. All right, so we're starting off with adjacent possibilities. The thinking woman. Okay, so some of you guys may be um, looking at your options, weighing out your options, um, being in a very, like in a reflective state thinking about your possibilities then we have uh, fifth chakra archangel uh, gabriel and then we have envy okay give me just a moment So with, so we're here for adjacent possibilities. For some of you, there may be, there may be possibilities or options or opportunities that you may have overlooked or may not be aware of. Um, this this card is. Give me two seconds. This card can bring a little bit of uh, a feeling confused for some of you guys. You could be in a state of confusion. Um, maybe you don't have all the answers um, when it comes to a specific situation. And I feel like some of you guys are really going to be taking a second glance at things. I feel like you're going to be researching. Um, I feel like some of you are going to receive some type of spirit messages. Um, you could receive an email and it sparks some type of inspiration and you're like, oh, wow, I wasn't even thinking of that. Like that's that's somehow sometimes that's how spirit works. So with this card, it speaks about uh, self-expression, speaking your truth. I feel like when you go in this in this in this phase of reflecting and thinking, um, it's gonna give you it's gonna like ignite some type of power in you or some type of energy of having very clear communication and clear thinking, clear thoughts. If you didn't have it before, you will have it um, as May progresses. I'm almost seeing this like the Ace of Swords. Like you're going to have some type of new idea or some type of way, some type of new way of expressing yourself. You know, this also speaks about speaking up for yourself as well. Um, this may may be a good time as well if you're thinking about um, journaling if you do feel any blockages when it comes to your throat chakra then it would be very beneficial for you to um, look into automatic writing if you don't know what that is you can always google it or look on youtube and there's resources for automatic writing as well i feel like with automatic writing that it will be a very freeing experience to you. And when you do it, 
and you get the messages that flow through you, then you may be surprised that you may get answers to things that you were already looking for. So when envy here, you know, it's a, it's an energy of um, of lack, almost like the five of cups, a, a feeling of uh, just being dissatisfied. You know, this could be your energy or someone around you. Um, just kind of, you know, being in the energy of not being grateful, taking things for granted. You know, you may have someone like that around you that just doesn't appreciate things or, you know, it could be your energy as well. So I'm going to get a few clarifying cards. So please clarify adjacent, adjacent possibilities. All right. So there are your opportunities right there. You know, um, with the three of pentacles here, you know, this is about your expansion. This is about what you're building. You know, maybe there are certain um, opportunities that you're looking at that you didn't necessarily take into account maybe you're building something and I'm, I'm hearing the word building blocks and maybe you have certain pieces to the building box but maybe you need to get a mentor or um, someone or seek some type of professional help or some type of guidance because the three of pinnacles it also speaks about some type of apprenticeship next you have the star card so that speaks about you know some type of wish fulfillment some type of wish coming true um and also it stands for some type of yes yes answer like if you have a question i feel like some some type of wish fulfillment is going to come through in regards to what you're building some type of opportunity um and I feel like you're 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 very you're taking this you're I don't want to say you're taking the situation very serious, but you're really allowing yourself to move move intuitively, I guess. You know, you're really you're really relying on your intuition, you're really relying on your gut, whatever decision that you have to make. So with thinking woman, you have the four of swords. So the four of swords is all about rest, reflection, self-care, you know? Make sure you're taking care of yourself, mind, body, and spirit, right? And if it's not self-care for you, this is about reflecting. This is about going over your options, going over the details with like a fine tooth cone to make sure that you're not missing anything. And you have the Knight of Pentacles. There's there's some type of opportunity and some type of change coming in, for sure. Now, the Knight of Pentacles is a, it's a slow moving energy, so it may not move as fast as you want it to move. So this card does speak about patience. However, you know, this is the night that 99 point 99 percent of the time will follow through and achieve their his goal his or her goal so whatever you're focusing on right now you're thinking about you're reflecting about just know that it's going to be successful i feel like with some of you guys whatever this opportunity is is going to give you some type of voice is going to give you some type of uh passion some type of spark some type of something that you're going to be very dedicated towards you're going to be very focused with with this opportunity <clears throat> so you have the <clears throat> excuse me you have the knight of swords so with this energy with with this card coming up, you know, and the Knight of Swords, the Knight of Swords sometimes can speak without thinking and can be harsh and can be quick. And, you know, he or she could say a few things and then it just changes everything, right? And it, it may not be um, the most tactful way to say things. So if that is you, 
um, depending on what your other signs are. You know, if you tend to say things and you kind of bite your tongue or kick yourself in the butt, like, oh, why did I say that? Um, just mind your tongue and how you communicate um, for the month of May. For some of you, this speaks about some type of change coming in, some type of sudden change with the energy. It could be some type of communication coming in, some type of news about you moving forward, about your success. You know, the chariot speaks about a victory. You know, not only are you moving forward, you're moving forward successfully. So that's huge. Spirit, can you clarify the envy card? Ooh. Okay. So we have the page of swords coming out. So some some uh, type of messenger is going to be coming through. Messages are coming through in May. And, you know, these are the very beginning messages, right? So with envy coming up here, you may not like the way that the messages are delivered to you. You may not like the person that delivers them to you, um, either or, but this, there may be a underlining opportunity or valuable information from this person, from the situation that you need to look into. You need to look into the details of this because it's, it's something that is going to offer you with some type of creative fulfillment you know um with the empress showing up here you know she represents fertility growth prosperity so this this situation you know with this person with this page of wands the the person could be very shrewd they could be very sharp with their words especially with envy coming up here you know um we all, we all sign soul contracts before we get here, so you never know how someone is connected to you on a soul level. So, you know, you may think, oh, I don't need this person or this person's input means nothing to me, but you never know who's that person bringing you that news, bringing you that opportunity. I just heard golden, golden opportunity. It could be the person that you least expect. So if you if you are given any messages and the first, you know, knee jerk reaction, you're just like, whoa, like I'm not accepting that from that person or that information, you know, maybe be a little bit more open and just investigate it. Look into it. And then you have the devil card. So, you know, this this speaks about some type of uh, obligations some type of responsibilities, you know, you, you might have a lot on your plate. You might have a lot on your plate or, you know, that, that may take away from you being able to be as creative and passionate as you want to be, but you can't allow any type of obstacles to get in your way of your passion, of your creativity. You know, even if this is this person, you can't allow any person or any situation, you know, affect your energy like that. Spirit can have one more card. And then you have the death card. So, you know, this just speaks about, um, you know, you going through some type of transition. You know, this transition is going to lead to the end. This is like the cosmic garbage man and he's paving the way, you know, for your divine path. So, you know, trans transitions aren't always um, the most comfortable, you know, there's growth, there's, there's lessons, you know, but know that you are on your divine path and you're going to be successful. You're going to be victorious in this situation. So I'm really interested to see um, the comments and, and how these messages resonated with you. Very interesting read. 
So thank you so much for watching my video. All of my contact information is listed below. I hope you guys are safe and until next time.